What is up you guys? We are fishing, we're with Kyle again. And uh, we are fishing for carp at our favorite carp spot. Um, they're kind of spawning right now, so there's a bunch of fish in some flats. There's a, they're going crazy, there's a bunch of fish moving around. But the good thing about when they're spawning is we can actually target them um, like on the outskirts of the, of the big spawning pods of fish. So we should be able to get into some fish. Let's show you guys our rig real quick. So we're basically just fishing seven weight fly rods, large rubber reels. Um, you definitely want to have enough stuff. This is a loop Q rod and a loop Evotech reel. I'm fishing 13 pound uh, monofilament tippet. You could fish floor or whatever you want to fish. But um, that's basically the setup. I have a small black. It's actually balanced because why would I tie flies that aren't? I can't get that to focus. Why would I tie flies that aren't balanced at this point in my life? Kyle is running a wire worm. And we can just basically set these right on top of these fish. And uh, hopefully get them to eat it. So we're going to get started. We're going to walk right over here to where these fish are going crazy and see if we can't get one. Okay, so check this out. These are all spawning carp. Going crazy in here. There's a feeder right here, but these fish are all going nuts. Let's see if we can't get one of these to eat. I see one that's feeding right there. <laughs> this is crazy, look at this. These are all just massive carp, just cruising around right in front of us, not eating anything. We might be able to get an eat on a worm, just because they're aggressive, but I mean, there's a, there's a carp in there that's gotta be over freaking 25 pounds. These are stupid big. Look how big that carp is, right there. He's so long. What? Nuts. So the problem with um, fishing, spawning, like during a carp spawn, is there's so many fish that if you blind cast and are stripping your bugs in, you're kind of bound to snag a fish, as we see here. Pretty bummed about this. Kyle's like into his backing right now. Uh, but definitely less than ideal and not the uh, tiger thing, but it's definitely just a part of uh, a part of fishing this time of year. You just if you're if you're blind casting you will probably snag a fish or two. So I'm gonna get away from Kyle. And I'm gonna go try and find some feeding fish. It's been like 10 minutes. Kyle's just now getting this fish in. Seems pretty big. I left the net down at the farther part of our little walk here because I wasn't intending on us staying here. Let's see if we can get one of these fish to eat. Probably not. It's always worth a try though. Kyle has beached his fish. I will go aid him. It's out of here. Alright, let's go find some feeders. Bummer, we gotta find feeders. We're we going there. Okay, so this uh I'm not sure if this fish ate it or not. I put it in front of him and he just kinda swam by it and then my line started moving. And there's not a whole lot I can do. Like I'm like it's working here. Well into my backing. I, mean, I guess I could chase him. Should we chase him? No. Go get him. Oh, working you, dude. Oh my gosh. There's no way this fish is hooked in the mouth. There's no way. I'm tired. Uh, 
Oh, dang it. They must have slid up him. Dang it. We will catch fish in the mouth today. But we might need to move to the other side of the lake. Try to find some fish that aren't doing the deed so hard. Peace. So, Andrew finally got one to eat. Thank goodness. Dude, so, it's been so bad. Let's see how big it is. They've been like just spawning everywhere and we've been trying to find fish that we're feeding. And it's just been tough. We haven't really found any. This guy was just cruising. And then I dropped my bug on top of him. He just stopped. And then went down and sucked it up. Piggy. Yeah, definitely spawned out, that's for sure. Nope. Oh. Nice, dude. Sweet. Yeah. Very cool. My turn. We carp fishing, they were all, basically all spawning. Uh, I got one to eat, but it was kind of slow. So we are actually on our way back down, and we're gonna look for some um, smallmouth bass in a lake. We actually stopped here on our way up, and I caught like, I don't know, three or four, pound and a half. One was probably about two pound fish. Um, so we're gonna give it another go. It's a little bit windy but um, we might be able to get into some fish, so uh, stay tuned and let's see what we can do. So, we follow this trail, like, way around this corner, and uh, <laughs> we found a section of this lake that is like the most trout-looking lake of all time. Like, you got spruce trees, pine trees, this nice little trail opens up into this beautiful lake. Got some people hanging out, paddle boarding. But we're gonna catch some bass in this. So stay tuned, it's a little bit breezy, but we're gonna walk along this, find some deep structure, and look for some fish. So hopefully we can get in some. Okay, so our little scenic section of lake didn't really pan out. So we've moved along to this big uh, rock dike, which is actually kind of funny. It's an old bridge that they just never fixed. <laughs> so, let's see if Kyle can get a fish here. Oh, nice, dude. That's a good fish. <laughs> Every fish is a good fish, Kyle. Look at that bad boy. Ooh, hoo, hoo. swing her up. Nice smallie. Beautiful red eye. about throwing the booby now everywhere we go so this is what just happened oh oh yeah he'll eat it dude he's got to eat it he missed it so hard Yeah, dude. Oh, nice, man. <laughs> dude, they're so fun on top. <laughs> Little dink, but hey, who cares? That's so sick. Give me a gander of that bad boy. I'm telling you guys, these booby flies that I always tie, 
that everyone's like, man, stop tying boobies. It's only fly you tie. They are effective, as shown here. Ew! You get a little bit closer to make it look really big. Really big? Yeah. Uh, huge. What a mon, though. Send it. Oi, oi. Oh, he's on it. Oh. oh he it. He's not on it anymore. Oh, it's that same fish you already caught. He's still coming, he's still coming. Oh. Oh, he's sick. <laughs> I hit that so hard. <laughs> it's sweet. I don't think it was focused, but. Oh, whatever. I know, it was cool. There was nostril. Hold him up. Woo. Booby eater. Nice, dude. Got a good fish right here, eye on our fly. Oh. Dropped off there for a second. Let's see if we can get him. Coming. Oh, he's coming. Eat it, eat it. He's eyeing it. Give it a good move. Oh, oh. I'm stuck on that. No, oh, thank goodness. He does not want it. Entire video saved by booby content. What? Oh, I won't. Like warning, explicit boobies. Parental discretion. Massive booby content. Hey, bomb one right over there again. Oh, oh, oh! That's a big fish. Gotta get it on, like in close again like that. Oh yeah, dude, strip that, go. That was a good fish. Oh. Keep ripping, keep it going. Keep, he's on it, he's on it. Oh, he dropped off, okay, back out. That's a big fish, dude. Okay. Okay. This fish is gonna eat this, I can feel it. You got stuff on it. Yeah. You did. Oh. 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 Did you miss completely? Dude, dude he, did he yeah. Miss it? No, he had it. I don't know how that missed You just it. didn't know. Fucking, I freaking popped it. <laughs> Pretty hard. Oh. 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 He missed it. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. Oh, he missed it. He's right in front of me. Oh. Oh. No, he missed it twice. Keep it going. Keep it going. Oh, he turned off it. Yeah. Keep going. Oh, dude, he came up and mid. Oh, he was still going. Go for it again. Yeah. Fish are aggressively chasing this bug. Keep it going. Keep it going. You've got two. Oh, dude, you had two big fish chase it. Oh, <laughs> he missed it. Keep it going. Oh, how did that not eat it? Oh, keep it going. Oh, nice, dude. It's a good fish. Yeah. Hopefully I got it. <laughs> that was sweet, dude. He, like, T-boned it. 
Let's go see what we got. Oh, I got another fish. I got like five fish on this guy trying to eat it. I know. Nice, dude. Oh, that's a good fish. Yeah, that's a sweet fish to catch. On top. Up top. Booby, corner of the mouth. A nice, fat, small mouth. Stoked on that. <laughs> Funny. Zipper. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, he missed it. Get back on him. You're good, you're good. Man, he chased that hard. Get it back on him. That was a good fish, too. This fish actually came up Let's earlier. Fly in the mouth. Right there. Purple and white. This fish uh, came up, and I saw him from a little ways away. Um, cast him on, cast on him, and then the very first cast, I pop it twice, and then right as I pop the third time, he misses it, and it came back from below and just like crushed it, and then I just set into him. But there were a couple fish coming around, so that was cool. But we both have to be home to our ladies at some point today. I got a movie date night. What are you doing tonight, Kyle? Loathing your uh, loss of camera? Maybe. <laughs> Kyle's sunscreen exploded in his backpack and got all over his camera and it was like taking off the like the ceiling on the outside of it like stripping it off like paint stripper so okay we don't have to keep bringing it be up con be conscious <laughs> be conscious of that but yeah so we're gonna take off but thanks for watching it's a beautiful place cool place to catch smallmouth bass don't ever come here you never come here you don't you didn't even know where it is but Thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. I'm going to link Kyle's Instagram below so you guys can go give him a follow and check out some of his stuff. And, uh, yeah. It's better than Andrew's. <laughs> <laughs> so humble.